Johnson grass is a grassy weed that poses a particular problem for agricultural property owners. This weed not only reduces crop yields, but it is also toxic to grazing animals like cows or horses. In this video, we'll show you how to identify Johnson grass, how to get rid of Johnson grass, and how to prevent it from growing back. To shop for the products featured in this video and to learn more about lawn care, click the links in the video's description and get free shipping on your order. The first thing you should do in any pest control plan is identify what exactly you're dealing with. Careless identification can lead to wrong treatment methods, costing you time and money. Johnson grass typically grows in patches or clumps that can reach 3 to 7 feet in height. The plant's leaves grow 6 to 20 inches in length and are 10 to 30 millimeters wide. The leaves have prominent white mid-veins, and they are usually hairless on both sides. When this plant flowers, the inflorescence, or flower head, takes on an open panicle shape. The seeds take on a reddish-brown color as they develop. Inspection is the next phase of any good pest control plan. Once you know what to look for, check around your property to confirm the weed's presence or find activity hotspots. Johnson grass is a warm season perennial. It germinates when soil temperatures reach 60 to 70 degrees Fahrenheit. This plant thrives in areas with moist, fertile soil. Common sites where this weed can be found include lawns, crop fields, ditches, roadsides, and other disturbed sites. Johnson grass flowers from May to October. After identifying your weed and inspecting your property, it's time to start treatment. Before starting any treatment, be sure to wear your personal protective equipment or PPE and remember to keep people and pets out of the treated areas until products dry completely. To eliminate Johnson grass on commercial or residential properties, use a selective post-emergent herbicide that's labeled not to injure your property's turf grass. We recommend you check out Certainty Turf Herbicide. Certainty is a water dispersible granule made with sulfosulfuron and controls weeds in warm season turf. To treat Johnson grass, mix the labeled rate of 0.75 ounces of Certainty in 2 gallons of water per 1,000 square feet of treatment area. We recommend you mix and apply your product in a handheld sprayer or a backpack sprayer. Spot treat any Johnson grass you've found. Use a fan or cone spray pattern to ensure the weeds are fully coated and spray the weeds to the point of wet but not runoff. Be sure to spray on calm days when temperatures are not too hot and when wind speeds are low to minimize drift. When applied properly, affected weeds will yellow and begin to die. Conduct follow-up applications as necessary. A reapplication with certainty may be made four weeks after the initial treatment. Applications are most effective when the plant is young and actively growing before flower or seed production. Prevention is essential to keeping weeds in check. Even after applying herbicides, the best way to stop weed activity is to ensure it can't happen. Johnson grass is a perennial weed that spreads by seed and rhizome. The best way to prevent new plants from growing from seed is by applying a pre-emergent herbicide like Barricade. Barricade granular pre-emergent herbicide will form a chemical barrier in your soil that will prevent weed seeds from sprouting and emerging. Depending on your turf grass species, you'll apply 1.5 to 4 pounds of product per 1,000 square feet. After application, water in the product with at least half an inch of water. Make an application in the fall to stop weeds from germinating in spring. An additional application may be made after six months for year-round weed prevention. In addition to pre-emergent herbicides, we also recommend you promote the health of your turf to reduce the conducive conditions that allow weeds and disease to take hold. Mow your grass at proper intervals to maintain a thick growing density. A lawn dense with taller, trimmed grass is better able to choke out weeds and prevent them from establishing. Reduce the shade cast on your lawn by trimming overgrown shrubbery and tree branches, rake away leaf litter and pick up any debris, and employ a proper watering schedule to provide the local grass with enough water to strengthen its roots, but not so much that will encourage weeds. Many grasses require one inch of water every week. Apply the water all at once in the morning so it has time to seep into the ground without evaporating in the sun. With these professional products and tips from Solutions Pest and Lawn, you can stop Johnson grass from establishment, and we offer fast, free shipping to help you get control quickly. Visit our website to get your products today. If you like this how-to guide, please share. And if you're new to our channel, subscribe for more how-to and product videos. And contact us for more tips, tricks, and DIY pest solutions.